Leading local tonight in our top story, the trial continues for 16 year old Jesse Taylor Jr. who police say shot and killed 28 year old Maurice Thundershield. It was day five in the courtroom today. It was spent reviewing more footage from the surveillance camera at the Motel 6 in Bismarck. The detective working the case, John Lars, says that footage was condensed to areas of interest. Essentially, I gave him a description of five or six people and where the incident occurred and to try to just kind of focus on that area. One clip showed Thundershield alone throwing a trash can off the motel balcony and another shows him bouncing around and acting animated just before its death. Lar also described his interview with Taylor's aunt Chrissy Ray's after the shooting, saying she did not mention Thundershield making any threatening remarks. However, Ray's testified that she heard Thundershield make threatening remarks to her and to Taylor and said that she feared for Taylor's safety. Lar also said that he worked with law enforcement in Minnesota to recover evidence that belonged to Taylor from Ray's home. Were there any items of evidence that you collected while you were in Warren? There were two items that I took possession of from Agent Bellin with the BCA. And do you recall what those items were? One was a black Nike hooded sweatshirt, and then the other, I believe it was a tan hooded sweatshirt. Two more witnesses from Maryland were expected to testify today, but attorneys say they will question them on Tuesday.